200 miles from Chinese-held Tibet is the Indian hill station of Simla. And some of the Tibetan refugees who are exiled there are very young indeed. Now the Save the Children Fund has bought two big houses in Simla as a home for 230 of these youngsters between two and eight years old. A staff of Tibetan and English girls look after the children whose parents are either dead or too poor to maintain them. The Overseas Relief and Welfare Committee of the Save the Children Fund is represented by its chairman, Lady Alexander Metcalf, who spent her own childhood in Simla and whose husband once owned one of the two houses. Today is a gala day for the Dalai Lama himself, spiritual leader of the Tibetan people, has come to declare the home officially open. Like most of his audience, the Dalai Lama too is an exile, to whom all Tibetans, whether they have stayed in their mountain home or fled the Chinese invasion, look up for inspiration and guidance. Highlight of the day's celebration is the presenting of white scarves, the traditional Tibetan gift which carries a blessing with it. These children must grow up physically strong, well-educated and aware of their ancient culture, the Dalai Lama tells them. They have lost their home, but here they will be loved and cared for till they can return to their native land.